Here we go, guys. We're out here at Fort Pickens. We have never been out here yet, but this is sweet. Welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel. There's some, there's some sands. Can't see the waters yet. Let's roll that intro. We'll get you guys some more footage out here. some somewhere at the fort we'll go give this whole thing a view look at all that like Dang. yeah they got some big old cannons out there oh i found us a house <laughs> mm, there's a house out here <laughs> probably not for sale that's cool but it says do not enter oh. historic fort picking store that way and i don't even know i don't know we're following cameron he's in front of us he's he's guiding us so here's a little guide because sadly it's after 4 30 it's 5 17. so the visitor center here is closed but check this out so there's Pensacola. We drive over this bridge and then over the little bridge and came all the way down here and that's where we are. My man. How cool. Whoa. All right, after a five hour walk, here we are. Whatever. It wasn't five hours. I'm just being a goofball. Beefing up defenses. Oh. Oh, swatting mosquitoes. <laughs> That's cool. Now we're inside. Ooh, artillery tools. Look at that thing. That's sweet. We're in a really small tunnel. Really small. But there's a light. Oh shit. Is it dead end? Turn around. <laughs> it's a dead end. Turn around. There's not shit back here. <laughs> there's nothing. <laughs> oh man. Nothing, that's probably where they... Oh, we watch your head. A hole? That fucking hurt. Is there actually something down there? Because that's a... Let that to find out. Yeah. Look, look, there's two ways. That's a dead end. That's a dead end, I bet. And there's another one. Dead end? I don't know what they put down there. Little tunnel. I thought it was gonna come out like over here somewhere. <laughs> Dang, look at that big hole up there. But there's nothing. It's where they cooked. I don't know. Hey, it's wet right there, it's dripping. Dripping water. <laughs> and back. All right, here. We, oh, watch your step. Here we go. Hello. Hey, somebody's down there at the end of this thing. 
Say my name. Look, there's lots of footsteps, but it gets wet. I'm pretty sure it looks like it gets wet. Look, my camera's better than my eyeballs right here. Yeah, it's starting to get a little wet. <laughs> Why are they running? Oh my goodness. There's a bat right away. <laughs> Come on, Brittany. <laughs> she did. She ran. Look. It looked at me. That's it's it. It's a dead end. Look at the That's cool. Yeah, it's real wet down there. It's pretty cool. Now we just start running. Oh wait, my flashlight's still on. That's okay. But check this out. It's because we're down in that tunnel. And then there's a big cannon up here. Let's go check it out. Oh, well, alright, we just climbed about 20 steps. Now we're on top. Yeah, keep off. Don't climb on it. It's so cool. So we came in through there. Walked all the way around this thing, all the way up to here, and now, boom! Is it closed off, Daddy? Daddy, is it closed off? The jail cell's over there. Is it closed off? Look at that thing. Huh? How far can it shoot? Enemy ship approaching. Let's find out. <laughs> so here's the fort. We're right there. Inside of Fort McCree. Dang. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. So, we're over here. Fort Pickens, right? We're like literally right there. And then, if we look out this way, back there was the Navy Yard, which now you can see the wall, the tower. The lighthouse. Let me see. Zoom in a little bit on it. The lighthouse. And then so straight across over that way was Fort McCree. And it says that November 22nd to and 23rd in 1861, this would be the Civil War battle. A Civil, Civil War battle between the Union troops on Fort Pickens here where we're at and the Confederate soldiers over at Fort McCree. And Confederate General Braxton Bragg said, for the number and caliper of guns and weight of metal brought into action, it will rank with the heaviest bombardment in the world. Like, that's wild. But when you consider that big guy right there, whew, Apparently there were two battleships also involved helping out. So, lots of history here. <laughs> ammo exit. Exit that ammo. That's what that room was for we were just in. Probably so. Why? Why? You just roll that shell down. Do it. Then it'll go down? Yeah. How cool. Did you even die in here? What is that one? Alright, we just climbed 29 steps. So beautiful. So it appears that here didn't used to look like that until a fire broke out and 8,000 pounds of gunpowder exploded, killing one private and injuring another private. Wow. 8,000 pounds of gunpowder. 
There's your view from outside where the 8,000 pounds of gunpowder blew up. Look at that thing. That's a mine. I'm going to put my hand on it. For the water. And that's the little mine building. Dang. Look at this big old gun. Woo wee! Big old gun. Where's that big old gun? <laughs> You're supposed to like go like this. Well, there's stairs and really cool views, and now we're coming back down. Look at this. Nope, I don't see him. He must have left. <laughs> so I wonder what these are used for, like. <laughs> yeah. How many behind Look at mommy, stay here with me. Look at mommy. <laughs> Check that out. So we are now down here on the ground, but we were at the very top up there. Take these stairs right here all the way up. <laughs> this is not. Well, guys, that's going to do it for Fort Pickens here. What a beautiful place. Definitely recommend checking it out. We got a one to seven day pass for $25. Completely worth it. We come back out here again. They got some camping out here. Lots of cool things to explore that we showed you guys. Lots of good stuff to see. God is amazing. You guys and smash that thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to click that red subscribe button and head over to the family channel and subscribe there as well. We'll catch you on the next one. God bless. Don't ever give up. God is here with you. Yeah. You are a child. Nothing but love is true. Just got to fix your view. Keep your eyes on the prize. That's life everlasting. Only through Jesus Christ. He came to die.